Hi, this is Elena from Studio Denmark, and this is just a quick tutorial to show you how to use a clipping mask in Procreate. So just a quick note that I am demonstrating with a glitter brush from my Gold Rush set, but the glitter brushes from my lettering set are a little bit different, and I've shown in a different video how to use those. But you can go ahead and use this method on any of my Gold Rush brushes, my lettering brushes, and any other brushes that you have, as long as they are solid and not semi-transparent. So I've got Procreate open here, and I'm just going to add a new layer and swipe up from the bottom, grab that Files app and drag it over to the side. And this is where I've saved my Gold Rush textures. You might need to navigate to where you've saved yours on your Files app. And then grab a texture and drag and drop it in to Procreate. And I'll hit that arrow up the top to deselect. And now in my Layers panel, um, tap the texture and then tap Clipping Mask. And now it's applied to the layer below it. And even though you can't actually see that, it's, uh, it's really cool. You can go ahead and uh, select a brush and then start drawing on the canvas and you'll see that the texture is already applied. So it's like you're drawing in the texture already. And you can actually go back to the layers panel and turn that off if you want to. Or you can easily just go ahead and add another texture if you want to try something different. And you can use a clipping mask at any point in your project before or after you've drawn on your canvas. So you may want to use a custom color on your drawing and you can easily do that. You just need to add another layer above and uh, go and select your color. Um, I'm just going to select this pink color and now just take it and drag it and drop it into that new layer. So we have to change the blending mode now uh, by tapping this N over on the side of the layer and then go to uh, color down at the bottom and then select color again. And now it colors everything below it and just to make sure it doesn't color something else if you add something else just make that a clipping mask as well. So that was just quickly how to use a clipping mask in Procreate, which I think is a very, very much needed and wonderful update that they have had. So it um, makes it really easy to apply textures and to get really creative and have a lot of fun. So I hope you enjoy.